Good morning, everyone. Don't mind my hair. Today is a very much needed house declutter because I have a ton of random stuff in my house that I need to get rid of. So I'm going to do that. I already cleared up my basement because I did buy a treadmill, which I'm so excited about because now I can do the 12, 3, 30 workout. If you don't know what that is, it means it's 12 incline, three speed and 30 minutes. Although I'll probably do like variations of it so I have a treadmill that I need to put together I cleared out my basement because there's just a ton of like random junk in there that I really don't need anymore as much as I like to buy things you guys know like I hate clutter so I usually declutter um, I'm very happy because most of the stuff that I'm decluttering is actually going to a family friend I try not to bring things to like the thrift store or just like get rid of them at the junkyard because like it just creates more waste in this world I know I'm very like hypocritical because I, I struggle with this all the time okay because I like stuff and I buy stuff all the time but I also hate like <laughs> throwing things out so not in a hoarder sense in a, in, in a sense where like I love to declutter but then I don't like to like just dump it at the thrift store so a lot of times I ask my family friends and um, family members if they want anything and I'm very lucky I have one friend that is taking like four bags of stuff because she has two kids and then herself like she knows I buy a lot of like nice stuff so she's taking up a lot of that stuff and then I do have some bed sheets that I'm getting rid of I want to go and call the Humane Society to see if they want to take them for the dogs and cats and I have some pillows so I'm gonna ask if they want those things too otherwise I'm not really sure what I can do with that stuff um yeah, I'll have to figure that out. But right now, at the moment, I am washing some laundry. Today is like a major laundry day for me. I'm washing Harley's sheets because I put um, sheets over his Casper beds. Just because the Casper gets a little bit grimy if you don't put a sheet over it. And honestly, yesterday I was cleaning and I realized my room smells really, um, like really strongly of dog. Because obviously I have Harley. Uh, it doesn't bother me, but I was like... Ooh, it's a little bit stanky in here and right now I am cleaning my white sheets I threw all my white sheets in the bathtub I put oxyclean revive uh, white revive I put Dawn dish soap and then it's a ton of water and um, baking soda in there I'm just soaking them to see if I can get like the body sweat out of it if you sleep on white sheets then you know like no matter like what sweat during the night and your body heat and it just like absorbs and the lotions absorb into the um into the sheets so i'm soaking it i already did one soak yesterday night and then i cleared it this morning at like 8 a.m and then i'm soaking it again so let me show you guys what that looks like okay so this has been soaking for a while you can see like it's a little bit grimy looking um regardless of the light and then you can see how like dark the water is getting i'm gonna soak this for another i don't know Probably I won't get to this until the evening because I want all the dirt out. And then I have to run this through the wash kind of twice uh, with vinegar to like really get all the chemicals out. I don't have any like actual bleach in here because I know bleach tends to um, turn things yellow. And I don't have any of that blue dye stuff that will get rid of that or balance out the color tone. So I'm going to try this first and then if this doesn't get my sheets completely white then I'll try to figure out something else a little bit of pepper salt dash of red pepper well, I don't know how you guys like your eggs but I like my eggs runny uh, this is a little bit too runny but I'm just cooking it on very low heat. Okay, I wanted to show you guys, sorry, in the background you might hear Ryan Ishida's um, channel. I'm just watching his videos. I wanted to show you guys how dirty this water looks. These were sheets that I literally wash regular in the washing machine. And look how dirty the water is. And this is a second round of like, um, my soaking. So I can see that the sheets are getting like, a lot more white now that they've soaked a second time. I'm going to throw half the load in to rinse 
and yeah, let's go do that. All right guys, I'm about to head out the door. We're going to go visit some family friends, but I wanted to show you guys this item because I'm going to use it right now. I had the lovely brand Costan reach out to me and say, hey, we want to send Harley something. This is not sponsored at all. They sent me something so beautiful. Well, they didn't even send me something so beautiful. They sent Harley something so beautiful and it's so meaningful to me when when people think about my dog because my dog is literally everything to me. So I want to make a disclaimer. I'm not showing you this because I'm getting paid because it's not paid. This is not a sponsored video, but they did gift this item to me. I want to be very clear that when I take brand deals or like gifted items, I'm very picky because it needs to have some sort of purpose in my life. And if I took every like beauty product, hair vitamin, I don't know, whatever clothing item that like brands wanted to send me. Like if I took 90% of the brand deals, like I'd have a crap ton of stuff and like an abundance of things that I don't need. So let's get on to it. This is what it came in. It was beautifully wrapped to make sure like everything was secure and the box is really beautiful. I honestly think if you had like a dog lover in your life that you don't know what to gift them like usually people if they don't know what to gift me because I buy everything like I already want um, they'll buy something for Harley and I usually appreciate that 10 times more because I'm just so picky so it comes beautifully wrapped and look how beautiful this packaging is it came in a dust bag like both the items came in dust bags so yes there's dog hair on this because i've already unboxed it to make sure i liked the product myself um, and i didn't have any issues with it so there's do dog hair on it but here it is so the dog so the dust bag is beautiful it is like really high quality um Kostan is based in vancouver they started in 2019 Kostan is actually a fashion and lifestyle e-commerce website they started in 2019 they're based in vancouver which i love because obviously you guys know i like to support local so the first thing they sent to me was this this is the essentials lead in um sage green and it is beautiful this is four feet so it's actually quite perfect for me because i don't like having harley go too far away from me also he can't actually walk that far away from me anymore because of his osteoarthritis so he's usually next to me or I'm actually usually kind of being like hey let's go buddy I'm just so excited because usually dog company brands make things for small dogs and they never include the large dogs and my dog is chunky he is a chubbolino so like I'm so excited that this brand actually included like an adjustable harness and lead so my dog could wear it there's a k right here like it the detailing is just so gorgeous like you can see it says cost on right there here you can see this is where the toggle is you hold your the lead here and then this is the toggle to hold the poop bag they they graciously also sent me a poop bag they don't have the poop bag and sage green i believe so they sent me this one which is fine it is gorgeous. You just open it in the back here and the poop bags go through and I really love how they just kind of slip out. And then once again, the logo is right there. Everything is vegan leather, so nothing is made of real leather. And you can see like this is gold. So if you do order the gray lead or like the gray uh, harness or collar, then it comes with the gold hardware. So they do have collars as well if you're a person who prefers a collar on your dog. This is what the harness looks like which it is so beautiful so this goes around the neck and then this goes around i will show you what it looks like on harley uh, around the body there's a lot of places that you can actually clip the lead onto and the detailing once again like look that is gorgeous everything is so beautiful you could also clip it here if you wanted to like you have tons of options and it's highly adjustable so in case you are wondering this is the essentials harness in sage green and he has it in a size large but they do have an extra large as well so if you have a bigger dog than harley then you can definitely get the extra large but this is also adjustable so if you had a bigger dog like this could definitely fit him so i'm super excited i just want to thank cost on once again like ash thank you so much for sending harley this item this is really beautiful yeah we're gonna go on a walk and use it now okay i just needed to show you guys him wearing the harness like how cute is that okay sweet harley here is going to try for the very first time Bing Sue, my friend made it and she brought it over for me. 
Was it nummies? Can you pay my bills? Can't pay my telephone bills. Can't pay my automobiles. Oh, it took me long enough, but it's done. Woo! I'm not gonna turn it on now. I'm gonna go to bed. Actually, I'm gonna shower. But it's cool because it has a fan. It doesn't feel that stable, and also I couldn't get this up, so I'll deal with this tomorrow. Don't mind the mess. I'm just wearing a shoulder pad tee tucked into these really old um, Wilford pants. I forget what they're called, but they, I think they're the Durantals. And then, oh, I need to put rings on. My Majuri Bold, no, my B Majuri Boyfriend Link chain, the Shop Anjoui Chanel, and I need to put rings on. Okay, so I changed up the stack. I'm wearing the Cartier on my left hand with two croissant domes, a linear Helen, and then the Charlotte. And I do still have 10% off for Majuri. It is always linked in the description. Thank you for supporting me. Just going to All right, guys. I know I usually do weekend vlogs, but I got a package in the mail that I have been waiting for. Um, I'm super excited. They're not even for me. They're for Alex. She asked me if I could enter the draw for these Adidas um, Yeezy shoes, shoes, slide things. Um, as you guys know, Yeezys are very hard to grab. So she asked me if I could put my name down for these. These, I don't even know what they're called. They didn't even come in a Yeezy box. Is that bizarre? Like they come in a box like this. Okay, anyways. Oh yeah, okay, so it is like that. So it says foam. I think these are like the foam runners or something like that. <laughs> Alex, what? <laughs> They're so funny. So she got them in a size four. My feet definitely won't fit these, but they are like a foam, I call them whipped cream shoes because that's what they look like. They had two colors come out this past um, drop and it just dropped like last weekend. So by the time you see this, it's gone, but uh, usually they tell you what drops they're having with Yeezy and then you sign up and then if you win the draw to purchase the shoes they ship them to you right away and you have to pay for them um, if you win and there's no returns I believe on these things which is so bizarre but this is this they are I don't even know what color these are in I don't know, but they're so funny. She said I could unbox them and show you guys what they look like. I wish I could put them on my feet, but my feet are definitely not this size. Like these are really, really tiny. And <laughs> they just look like whipped cream shoes. Alex, how are you gonna wear these? Girl, I need to see them on her like in action because they literally look like, it looks like a coffee cream. It's a Starbucks cold foam. That's hilarious. They're much wider than I thought they were going to be. But I can see them being very comfortable. If I could get a pair of the Yeezy slides, I definitely would. But these are just real out there, girl. Um, but they look very comfortable. So anyways, if anyone wants to let me know on how to wear these shoes, definitely let me know. Not that I have a pair because... Um, I entered the, this draw for Alex, but hilarious, right? Now we have to meet up Alex so I can give you your <laughs> whipped cream shoes. <laughs> so funny. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I just wanted to end the vlog on some sort of a unboxing because I thought you would find this hilarious. Make sure to follow me on Instagram at underscore Hello Harley. Make sure to follow me on TikTok at Hello Harley, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.